I was looking at, uh, oh, let me see, I can, okay. I was looking at number 64, which throws out the idea that you might have a convergent sequence and another convergent sequence. Uh, and both of those sequences have a series of terms. And if you consider um, the series whose sequence of terms is the product of the elements of the sequence in the other two series, uh, the idea is to show that this can, that the, while the sum of the products of the elements of the sequence does converge, it does not converge to the product of the sums of the series. So um, I just fooled around with it. I know that uh, this geometric series converges to 3 halves, and this geometric series converges to 2. So I'm going to say, well, this converges to 3 halves, and this converges to 2. Um, the series, this uh, is, okay, so that's the sum from 0 to infinity of 1 sixth to the nth power. 1 over 1 minus 1 sixth, or 1 over 5 sixths is 6 fifths, is not equal to 3 halves times 2. Okay, because that would be 3, and 3 is not equal to 6 halves. So, uh, in general, we do not have that the sum from n equals 0 to infinity a n times so from 0 to infinity of b n is the sum of a n times b n. Right? So, um, there. So in, what we want to say is that the product of the sums is, in general, not the sum of the products.